Let's destructively distillate coal. What do I mean by that? When I talk about destructive distillation, I'm talking about heating up coal in the absence of air. In fact, if you heat anything in the absence of air, you call such an activity as destructive distillation. Finely powdered coal is taken in a test tube and is heated. As the coal breaks down, coke is formed. Coal tar, ammonia and coal gas are also produced. Coal tar collects in the bottom of the second test tube. It is actually black, thick liquid which has got a very unpleasant smell. It is actually a mixture of around 200 substances and coal gas escapes through the side of the test tube. The ammonia produced is absorbed in the water in this particular test tube and it finally forms ammonical liquor or ammonium hydroxide. The black residue left out in this particular test tube is called coke. It is actually a tough, porous and black substance. It is almost pure form of carbon. We would definitely not do all this activity if it did not give us any end result. That is, if all of these products are not going to be used and therefore we definitely have use for these products. The coal gas also called as town gas is a mixture of hydrogen, methane and carbon monoxide which are combustible making the coal gas an excellent fuel and having high calorific values that is it gives out a lot of energy when it is being burned. Liquor ammonia or ammonium hydroxide is used to make fertilizers. The coal tar that was basically accumulated in the test tube out here is produced of around 200 various substances. The products obtained from coal tar are used as starting material for manufacturing of various substances used in everyday life and in industries like synthetic dyes, drugs, explosives, perfumes, plastic, paints, photographic material, roofing material, etc. Interestingly, naphthalene balls used to repel moths and other insects are also obtained from the same coal tar. Coke is a fuel in its own right, which can be used in homes and in factories. But it is largely used as a reducing agent in the extraction of metals from their ores. It is also used in making fuel gas like water gas, which is a mixture of carbon monoxide and hydrogen. Just to put some numbers across, on the destructive distillation of 1000 kgs of coal, you will get 700 kgs of coke, 100 liters of ammonia, 50 liters of coal tar and about 400 meter cube of coal gas. If you like this video and want to watch many many more amazing videos like these, like and subscribe to our channel now.